Yo, what's going on? And welcome back to Sekiro. And last time we finished... We did a lot of stuff in Mibu Village. I don't know that we're actually done with it. Um, I did look back. And even though I looked at the menu, for some reason I just didn't see the pine resin right here. It turns out it was in upgrade materials. So that's going to be used to upgrade our flame vent at some point. <clears throat> and we actually have 800 monies right now. So I was thinking that maybe we look into upgrading our shinobi sure. tools, as we haven't really upgraded very many of those. We don't have any new tools, right? Nope. So I'd like to look at some of these upgrades. Maybe pick one. We probably have enough for two, so we'll probably buy two right now, and we'll hold off on the mask just a little longer. I don't want to not have the mask pieces when we need them, assuming we it's like a timed thing, and we'll like run into an encounter and all of a sudden need to have the pieces already. So that makes me a little bit nervous, but I think we're okay at the moment. And since we're, we only have 800 gold, it's not like we're close to 5,000. I can pop all of our coin purses and have 5,000 immediately, like at a moment's notice. So I'm not as concerned because of that, but I don't want to miss something either. So we're looking at the loaded spear, which we don't use a whole lot. Lighter enemies struck by the spear may be dragged towards the wielder. You can also tear armor and use its momentum for successive and relentless thrusts. All right, what does a spring-loaded axe do? To shrug off incoming attacks and can easily turn a... In the spring mechanism allows for large sweeping attacks despite its weight. How do you do that? Hold. Okay. And this is the double whoop de doo. Can be waved twice in succession. So I guess that just means when we, because um, we kind of take a stance the first time we use it. Yeah, so we probably take the stance and then we can just. Uh, use the charge twice instead of just once where we would then have to charge it again um, a massive blast of flames sending opponents flying huh none of these seem that great except for the axe which is why I'm definitely gonna get the axe <clears throat> yes sir And we don't have enough money for that. We got, so where are our phantom kunai? Our phantom kunai are over there, which is gonna require both of these. So I think I'm gonna stick in the top tree for now. <clears throat> and there's some cool looking stuff here. So don't think that I'm just ignoring that, even though I have been for a lot of the game. It's just like, I feel like I never have enough money. Just constantly at a money deficit here. But I do want to go check that pond again, because I believe that pond in Mibu Village is where this carp has to be. We can look at the message real quick too once we get here. Because I didn't kill all the carp when I jumped in, but I don't remember necessarily seeing one with red eyes. So it's going to be under here. What are we looking for? Surgeon's stained letter. A te okay, at the bottom of Mibu Village Pond, you will find a Sakura carp. You will know it from its red eyes, which are said to never rot. I need those eyes. All right, so like, I feel like this is the pond. Now, how how would we get to the bottom of the pond? I 
It does appear that there's something in the water that this guy is sending down the stream. Now we're looking for carp here. There's a carp. There's a few carp. Are you the carp I'm looking for? Maybe it's one of you? Alright, we got him. Now we're gonna need these carp to come up, which might require us to kill all the carp first. Appears to be another one right here. That carp just jumped out at me, alright. Let's go, punk. Got him. Alright, where are you at though? There's two more down there, three more, four more. That's all I can identify. Oh, here, I have I got an idea. Um this. Can we not do that while we're in the water? We might have to get on a boat. Oh whoops. Too much jump. Oh no. It like buffers your jumps. There we go. Just calm it down. Now I can't lock onto them from here? Dang it. Oh, maybe they were just too far down? Hold your horse. How do I... It seems like I can only lock onto them while swimming. I do not appear to be able to use any shinobi tools while swimming either. So how would I attract these? I'm trying to lock on anything else. I don't know how I would get the carp to come up. I was thinking the finger because the finger whistle because that's what it's meant for. Yo, what? What? <laughs> you kidding me? And we're back. Uh, the game just kind of said no. But I guess we're right here. I... Okay, so we found the four carp again. can't figure out, do they like move or? The second I get out of the water, I can't lock onto them anymore. Maybe if I just use it. I don't think they moved at all. Huh. There's gotta be some way to get them out, so maybe, um, maybe once we progress a little bit further, it will allow us to get the carp out. Maybe once we get to this guy that's supposedly putting stuff in the water, uh, once we stop him from putting stuff in the water, maybe the carp will come to the surface. Something like that. Uh, we don't have to rest because we technically just rested. Now we can go and investigate what this lady was all about. It's a nice little lantern. And I don't know what's coming up for us. Uh, I assume we're probably going to have a boss sometime soon. Why are you so sad? You have a basket on your head like that man that I killed. <laughs> are you baiting me? Why? 
今頃は佐久佐様どこにどうしてございましょうそれがわからぬのが悲しいのです会えずとも攻めて知りたいなれど頼りを出しても帰ってこぬ誰も居場所を教えてくれぬねえご神佐久佐様は出雲ですかうん知らぬああ、あなたも嘘つきどうしてみんな隠すのですかおう That was a uh, sweet. Alright, how do I hit you, lady? Okay, sweep again. I see. Nope. You gotta be careful here. Are you affected by firecrackers? Yes. Okay, I need to jump. If only I knew how to jump. What are you doing? Oh, I didn't jump again. What is this? Just so much damage. It's actually crazy. God. Holy potatoes. I assume maybe divine confetti would help with that. But she hurts like a ridiculous amount. Oh my lord. Okay, we definitely don't need uh I doubt we could poison her, but we could definitely try. Firecrackers also appeared to work, but... Um... How many divine confettis do we have? We have about 10. It's not a whole lot. I don't necessarily want to fight her if I don't have to. So maybe I'll just walk past her for now. Oh, you can't walk past her, huh? I mean, I talked to you. What do you want from me? Okay. Oh, 
Are you what? What kind of move was that? She just chases so quickly. What the heck? Come on. There we go. We did the. I think we need to do that more. Are you going to keep fighting? I need to get my posture back. Okay, she doesn't seem that complicated. She just has a few moves. Okay, I ran out of posture that time. I messed up. Give me back my posture. Come on. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I didn't realize I tried to jump because I thought it was the perilous attack but then I jumped over the death flow to do the death flow backstab it was that was a mess uh recovers vitality so now I guess we'll recover more vitality hmm all right I don't know why I had to kill her but I guess it was it was kind of forcing me like I tried talking to her. She didn't like it. I tried walking past her. She didn't like it She just had to be fought I suppose maybe I could have tried some other stuff, but That's what happens when You beat the person in a few tries instead of just dying repeatedly You tend to try more stuff when you die repeatedly Okay, why are you here? Why do you hate me? So we opened that chest last time. I know your moves. I've seen you before. Alright, that wasn't great. But it looked like I did a lot better than I did. I kind of mispressed some buttons. On that one Makiri counter, I got really lucky to deflect it. I was trying to Makiri, but then I pressed block instead and just deflected it. So I'd say that was a good portion of luck. What are you doing here? How much health do I get back? That's a lot of health. Did you see that? Which ninjutsu? Okay, we're still using the blood ninjutsu. I also might want to switch. I don't really think this Ichimoji is that good. 
kind of like the nightjar but we might change our mind oh big bellman huh bellman probably needs to die can't imagine I want to fight you. Oh, maybe I should have gone for the blood. Look at how much health that gives back. That is a lot. That's like a sixth of my HP now. It used to be an okay amount, but now it's a ridiculous amount. talking about but I do see that we can go this way oh, what's the point of oh that's the point of this gotcha 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 all right we're not gonna do that this very moment but we will be back there in just a moment I'm just gonna keep saying moment is there another way in? What am I looking at here? I can't really see because of how the camera moves when you jump. Something across the way here. Oh, can we actually make this or no? Can you not get on top of this rock? Dang it. We might have to go further up. Stream? Or this might just be unmakeable. <gasps> yeah, we might have to act. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's not good enough. What about if we're over on this side? Nope. We're gonna need like a slightly better angle, I'm thinking. Hmm. I think they designed this with <laughs> with it in mind that you're not supposed to be able to do that. Oh look at this though. So I guess, like, I kind of, that bridge, I took the furthest out pointing rock and jumped off of that one. Why didn't I pick up this one? <laughs> A prayer bead. All right. Well, you definitely want to come up here, whether or not you do it through those means. Hmm. How could we have gotten up here otherwise? Could we have gotten up here? There's also items down there. I feel like I kind of sequence broke a little bit, but maybe that'll give us an easier way to assassinate this guy, or at least an option to assassinate him, where otherwise I feel like we would just have to fight him. We'll see in a little second though. Any of these doors open? This is open. He seems to be just all alone in here. He's an NPC? Huh. Divine 
giant confetti. I thought he would be a fight. Pick up this item without breaking the pots. I don't want to startle him. I want to see what this looks like. We. <laughs> how how do you do that? You you're a spider. That's not possible. Okay, what are you doing? Boy. Boy, nani o shiteiru? Hmm. I kind of figured this guy would be like trying to manipulate these people. But it seems like he's just crazy. He just keeps having new weird dialogue, huh? Creeper. Mm -hmm. but, oh, what? I refuse to accept that I did not make that jump. Light coin purse. I would like to swim up the stream real quick. Because now we've kind of identified everything here. Any enemies? There are some carp. Nothing over there though. Oh, okay. Are you gonna fight or what are you doing? Oh, what the heck? Hmm. They don't appear to drop anything. This is just kinda it, huh? Can't go anywhere special. No more carp here. I wonder if you have to like kill all the carp maybe? To get them this to get the ones that we want to spawn. Or to come up. 
I do not know. It is very confusing. Alright, let's see what's over here. Get our gourd ready. We're kind of low on gourds. Should be careful in case we walk into a boss, which... This is looking pretty bossy, but... I'll walk into it. Much fear. Oh my lordy. That hurt a lot. I need to heal. Thank you. Oh wow. Okay, that's a Makiri. Gotcha. Uh, he doesn't really take damage, so I might need Divine Confetti for this. Posture back. We haven't even hit his posture yet, which sucks. Oh, wow. All right, fair enough. Oh, he has a second one. Okay, he does get hit by firecrackers. I'm just kind of learning him now, I think. Because this run's going to be tough to win with no healing. Oh, wow. Alright, fair enough. He seems very winnable. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, given, given better circumstances, I see that not being too difficult unless there's something else to that boss fight. I just feel like we took it on in a very unideal manner. We did use our second res though, I forgot that we fought this lady and used a res on her as well. So we might want to earn that res back. Is this guy back? He is. Really? Oh, these guys give health back? Alright, maybe we can get some health off of uh, these enemies up here. Oh, I forgot about you. Probably shouldn't have done this because it wastes a lot of spirit emblems.
We got a lot of our spirit emblems back. We're only two down. And this thing uses like eight. And we're back to full health, so that's a plus. Definitely liking the firecrackers for this guy. So far, at least. Uh, he doesn't build up terror, oddly enough. So I guess we don't have to really worry about that. Should we put anything else in this slot? We got our pellets in case we need them. Maybe just in case he actually does become a terror guy in like phase two or something. Oh, I missed the last one, dang it. Need to get our posture- What?! Okay, I disagree with what happened there. Give me my posture back. What?! I feel like I just keep barely, barely missing. Oh, you that add another attack, huh? I keep trying stuff. Stop trying stuff and just play smart. How? I feel like he's hitting me a lot when I sh don't feel like I should be getting hit. There we go. Oh wow, I switched. Hmm, pellets. Wow, that went right under everything, huh? What? Alright, hold on. Get my posture back. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that was a thing you could do. That makes me mad. That was a perfect time to punish, but... Are you dead? Alrighty then. Corrupted Monk, the battle memory of an extraordinary foe lingering in the mind of the wolf. Uh, the corrupted monk watched over the cave entrance deep in Mibu village. Known as Mibu breathing technique. Allows one to dive underwater as well as breathe underwater indefinitely. Developed by the founder of Mibu village, those who seek to join the procession must master the Mibu breathing technique. Without it, the divine dragon cannot be met. Hmm. So that's what we've been looking for, huh? So now I definitely want to go back and get those carp. Where are we at now? We are at Wedding Cave Door. And let us enhance our attack. 
The corrupted monk donned the mask of a fierce guardian deity. Her form was nebulous, appearing as if in a dream. What reason could there have been for the guarding the Mibu cave entrance? I do not know. All right, so we're going back to the village real quick. We do have one skill point, but I don't think that's going to be enough for anything. What do you mean not available? Oh, because I don't have the requirements. Gotcha. <laughs> Uh, and here we're probably looking for this virtuous thing. We still don't know what that last thing does, but I would like stuff that just makes us have to farm less. Always nice. How many, uh, we have about 300 spirit emblems. We tend to sit around 300, I believe. So we want to get back to the watermelon and try this diving. Which also means we need to go back to that uh, sunken valley place where I said that we need to dive. I figure it doesn't really matter what we take with us. Mibu breathing technique grants the ability to breathe underwater. With this power, one can remain underwater indefinitely. Right trigger is dive. Well, that would explain why your shinobi tool doesn't work while you're in the water because it had to work for this. Left trigger is surface. B while using the left stick is underwater dash. Seems pretty straightforward. Ooh, there's actually stuff down here though. Now this carp might not be easy. You gotta keep that in mind. Oh. Okay, red carp eyes. A carp that lived in the Mibu village pond. It has two red eyes. Carp with only eyes that are red cannot become masters. What? Though they're considered incomplete creatures that lack the ideal number of scales, their eyes are said to be everlasting. The researcher Dojin in the abandoned dungeon wants these eyes to improve his procedure. I thought the researcher's name was Dosaku or something. Dosaka. Something like that. Am I mistaken? I can block underwater? Hey, get back here. I feel like the fact that we can go underwater means there's so much more to explore, potentially. Also, these carp appear to be like locked to the surface. Alright, what is this? Just underwater chests? Alrighty. And there's our fourth prayer bead. Nice, nice, nice. A lot of people down here for being such a small village. Like a lot of people. What? Uh, I thought they were all moving. It's just kind of the water effects around me make them appear to move. I like swimming. Swimming seems to work quite well in this game. You can always just like dive, surface. Oh, swim up. All right, so let's go. Because there's multiple places that I would like to inspect now with the new knowledge that we can dive. There's a few around here, like specifically uh, by these waterfalls. I imagine we can probably dive. We'll see if there's actually anything of use. But I feel like they've only made 
certain zones diveable, or maybe just everything with water is diveable. Are you a carp? You are a treasure carp. That one looked kind of like a treasure carp. So I imagine the Harada estate might have stuff as well that now that we can dive. This kind of adds a lot of stuff to explore. What? Oh, this is under the waterfall, but it does not go anywhere. Fair enough. Oh, you can't actually exit the water. You're either like diving or you're not diving. You can't just swim up and call it good. Uh, get me up here. Oh, wow. You are a jerk, sir. Why? Why am I so dumb? Okay. I could not handle this man for whatever reason. Probably need to get rid of these guys. But maybe we don't. Let's find out. I assume they can't come down here. I wonder if this guy has a new interaction now that the Guardian is dead. I wonder if he'll dislike me breaking the pots, too. It's a few questions. Nope, you appear to be doing nothing new. That's a lot of noise. Alright, so this lake now. What are we looking at? Nothing really over here. Few of you guys, though. Oh, we got them all. That first swing killed two. I didn't realize. Precious bait. This is precious bait. The texture is slimy, and something resembling horns seem to jut out of it. Just the kind of bait the master loves. Ring the bell. Drop the bait. Hmm, because it was saying the, the carp with the red eyes can't become a master. I don't know what this master thing is. Seems very odd, though. So, we'll take the homeward idol, and I think we... We're running out of time here. So I think we're gonna go to that pond and dive down there and see what's in there. Hopefully it's not like a huge area or something. It might be a huge area. Let us enhance our physical attributes. This is the seventh prayer necklace. An unrivaled sumo wrestler once served a great feudal lord. Dismissed after giving to drink, he fell to a life of brigandry. And so he was dubbed Juzo the Drunk. <laughs> Alrighty, we know that dude. We know Mr. Juzo. Alright, so I'm gonna take us to this under shrine here. And then. For next time, we're gonna try and run over to where the, the little lake is, but that's gonna do it for this one.
hopefully you enjoyed we kind of we figured out how to get the eyes so we also need to go turn those in because that's kind of a quest that we're doing i don't feel that great about that quest but we might as well do it since it's the one that i'm that i picked so i guess we're doing that either way hopefully you enjoyed and i uh, will see you next time